everyone, here are your soulmate heart lockets. Only your soulmate will have the key to your heart. Only you will have the key to their heart. Jake is going to be your soulmate for sure. You guys are made for each other. You guys really think so? Hey, Brianna, do you think I would see for soulmates? Ew, nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Imagine your soulmate is nerdy Nathan. <laughs> No, Nathan, there's no way you're my soulmate. You're a nerd. That was a little harsh. Here's your test back, Brianna. No way, you got 100%. You're smart. No. Brianna, are you a nerd now? You should quit cheerleading and join the chess club with nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Nathan. Jake, it's time to see if we have the key to each other's hearts. I really hope you're my soulmate. You're the hottest girl in the school. And what else? That's it, you're hot. Nothing else matters, babe. <sighs> I guess. Does it fit? Does it fit? It doesn't. You're not my soulmate, Jake. So what? Who cares about a soulmate? That soulmate stuff is fake anyways. We're still gonna be together, right? We're both the hottest and most popular people in the school. Yeah. Of course. So are you and Jake soulmates? We're not. No way, but you guys were made for each other. But we're still gonna be together. Yay! You two are the perfect couple. Jake, why don't you break up with Brianna and just be with me? No way. She's way harder than you. You're just my side girlfriend. Why am I not even surprised? You deserve so much better than him. Just mind your business, dirty Nathan. Hey, Nathan. I'm sorry I yelled at you earlier. I was just really hurt. I'm used to it. Someone dropped their heart key. It unlocks my heart. Everyone, here are your soulmate heart lockets. Only your soulmate will have the key to your heart. And only you will have the key to their heart. Jake is going to be your soulmate for sure. You guys are made for each other. You guys really think so? Hey, Brianna, do you think I could see for soulmates? Ew, nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Imagine your soulmate's nerdy Nathan. <laughs> no, Nathan, there's no way you're my soulmate. You're a nerd. That was a little harsh. Here's your test back, Brianna. No way, you got 100%. You're smart. No. Brianna, are you a nerd now? You should quit cheerleading and join the chess club with nerdy Nathan. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Nathan. Jake, it's time to see if we have the key to each other's hearts. I really hope you're my soulmate. You're the hottest girl in the school. And what else? That's it. You're hot. Nothing else matters, babe. I guess. Does it fit? It. Be beautiful or be popular? I've always wanted to be beautiful. <laughs> Honey, I always thought you were beautiful. No one else thinks so, Mom. It's still loading. Holy <laughs> loser. Do us a favor and walk around with a bag over your head. Just, just you guys wait. I chose to be beautiful. I'm going to be the most beautiful girl in the school. <laughs> There's no way that you could ever be beautiful. I am going to be beautiful. That's what I chose. I'm the most beautiful girl in the school. There's no way you'd ever look better than me. Let's make a deal. When you become beautiful, if you can get Chad to go to prom with you over me, then I'll believe you. Deal. I like your shirt, Brianna. Really? <laughs> Thank you. Ew, why is Chad talking to ugly Brianna? <laughs> I'll talk to you again once I'm beautiful. Huh? It stopped loading. It didn't work. Nothing's changed. It stopped loading. It didn't work. Nothing's changed. Hey, Brianna, stop. I want to ask you something. Oh, you were talking to me. I wanted to ask you if you wanted to be my date to prom. <laughs> Yes! Well, well, looks like ugly Brianna is still ugly. It says I should be beautiful now, but it didn't work. Chad did ask me to prom, though. You can't go to prom with Chad. He's the hottest guy in the school, and you're ugly. You can only go with him if you become beautiful, or if you wear a bag for your head. Chad, we shouldn't go to prom together. Just wait. I should be beautiful any time now. What are you talking about? I chose to be beautiful. It finally stopped loading, but nothing changed. Brianna, nothing changed because you've always been beautiful. What? I chose to be beautiful. It finally stopped loading, but nothing changed. Brianna, nothing changed because you've always been beautiful. What? I've thought you were beautiful since the first time I laid eyes on you. No, you're just saying that to be nice. I'm not. I really mean it. <laughs> Thank you. I should go. I have to get to class. Brianna, look at yourself. You look beautiful. I look beautiful, but I don't even look like me. I'm going back to the way I was before. Is there something wrong with your brain? Why would you go back to looking ugly? Because she was never ugly. 
Chad, I don't get it. I'm the most beautiful girl in the school. Why did you choose her to go to prom with over me? You are beautiful. <laughs> on the outside. But inside, you're ugly. Come on, Rihanna. Okay. <laughs> Mommy, are we almost at the ice cream shop? <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, cover your mouth and nose. Come on, Weedy, we have to get out of here now. Huh? Mommy, why did you tell me to get out of there? I thought we were getting ice cream. If you hear laughing, you must cover your nose and mouth with the cloth I gave you. This cloth was created to fight against the laughing disease. Laughing is highly contagious and incurable. If you catch it, you'll die. Mommy, why didn't you wake me up for school? <laughs> Mommy? <laughs> Help! Help someone! Sweetie, what's going on? Why are you outside? Mommy's inside. She has the laughing disease. Don't worry, sweetie. I'll take care of mommy. Good morning, Dad. I'm off to school now. <laughs> Dad? <laughs> Good morning, Dad. I'm off to school now. <laughs> Dad? <laughs> How's my best friend today? My dad has a laughing disease. That means both my parents are gone. I can't go home tonight. Do you think I can stay at your place? I have to go. Where are you going? Your dad has the laughing disease. You could have caught it. I can't risk it. Stay away. Class, does anyone know the answer to? <laughs> Everyone out! Students, stay out here. I'll take care of Miss Applewood. That was so scary. Are you doing okay, Marie? I thought you didn't walk near you in case I'm contagious. You know what I said? I was just worried. <laughs> Babe, is everything okay? Jake, it's my best friend. Sophie has laughing disease. We have to get rid of her. <laughs> You're laughing. No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine. Best friend, Sophie, she has laughing disease. We have to get rid of her. <laughs> You're laughing. No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine. Please, please, I don't have it. I don't have the laughing disease. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm laughing. Goodbye, world. <laughs> <laughs> Brianna, stop! Stop laughing if you want to live! Stop what? Were you laughing? No! No! I was just practicing in case I did catch the laughing disease. The laughing disease is incurable. If you catch it, you're doomed. Now get to class. <laughs> stop! Stop laughing! I knew it. I knew you had the laughing disease. Say bye-bye, Brianna. No, no, I'm not infected, I'm telling you. Say bye-bye, Brianna. No, no, I'm not infected, I'm telling you. Look at my face. I'm not laughing. No, I saw you, you were laughing. You must have been seeing things. <laughs> tell me, <laughs> tell me the cure for the laughing disease. <laughs> I, I don't know, let go of me. Come with us, Brianna. Where am I? Who are you? What do you want from me? We need to know how you got cured from the laughing disease. What's the secret? Look, I don't know how I cured the disease. If I knew, I'd tell you. Let me see your arm. What are you doing? We're injecting you with the laughing disease so we can know your secret. No! <laughs> Everyone, put your mask on so you don't catch the laughing disease. She's laughing too much. We have to get rid of her or else we'll catch the laughing disease. Have you guys ever thought that maybe the laughing disease isn't deadly? You just kill everyone who gets it because you're afraid. <laughs> Good morning, mom. I spy with my little eye my mom. Here, take your vision blocking glasses. I spy with my little eye these vision blocking glasses. Wear them as much as you can so you don't have to say I spy all the time. I barely take mine off. I spy with my little eye the ground. I spy with my little eye the bush. I spy with my little eye the bus. Class, can anyone tell me why the earth is flat? My eyes are so itchy. My glasses, where'd they go? Timmy, say I spy. I spy with... I spy with my little eye a beautiful girl named Brianna. Chad, is that you? Of course it's me. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I... I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. I spot my little eye, Chad. Give me back my glasses. No way. I lost mine. Catch me if you can. I spy with my little eye, the wall. I spy with my little eye, Chad. 
I spy with my little eye my vision blocking glasses. Hey, give them back. No, they're mine. And if you have your eyes open, you need to say I spy. I spy with my little... Chad? Chad? Attention, everyone. For population control, you no longer wear your vision blocking glasses or keep your eyes closed for an extended period of time. Anyone who breaks these rules will be killed. I spy with my little eye. Mm, I'm in love with Timmy. Here, do the flower test. Yummy! No, don't eat it. To know if Timmy really loves you, you must do the flower test. Flower test? You must rip off each individual petal saying he loves me, he loves me not. If the final petal lands on he loves you, then he loves you. If the last petal lands on he does not, then he doesn't. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. Sweetie, what's wrong? Timmy doesn't love me. Why did Daddy come to pick me up at school too? He went to pick up milk. He's never coming back. Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in a life? Only if the flower says you really love me. Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in my life? Only if the flower says you really love me. He loves me? He loves me not. He loves me? He loves me not. You don't love me, Dad. Of course I love you. You're my daughter. Why'd you come back? Look, I need some money. I just need you to ask your mother. Not gonna happen. Why don't you go pick up milk like you said you were going to 10 years ago? Hey, baby. Are you okay? I love you. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. I love you too. I now pronounce you husband and... Wait. I need you to do the flower test. Right now? I now pronounce you husband and... Wait. I need you to do the flower test. Right now? Yes, I have to be sure. She loves me. She loves me not. She loves me. She loves me not. You don't love me. Why would you agree to marry me if you don't love me? I thought I did, but I wasn't sure. No, you knew. Because if you really loved me, you wouldn't even have to think about it. Truthfully, there's someone else. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, that was embarrassing. I love you, Timmy. Brianna, I love you too. I've loved you since I was six years old. What? But I did the flower test and you didn't love me back. It must have been wrong. Try again. The flower test doesn't lie. Please, just one more time. He loves me. He loves me not. <laughs> what are these hearts on my face for, Mom? The hearts represent how many people must fall in love with you before you can meet your soulmate. When they fall in love, you lose a heart. What's the gold heart for? That represents your soulmate. You'll only lose the gold heart when your soulmate falls in love with you. <laughs> Hi, Jake. What do you want? I really like your left elbow. <laughs> what does that even mean? Get out of here. Oh no, what's wrong? I need five people to fall in love with me. Look at me. It's never gonna happen. I'm a loser. You're not a loser. You're beautiful. You just need a makeover. Come with me. Who's that fine babe over there? Where? <laughs> He's talking about you. Oh, thank you. Don't snort. I, I think I'm in love with you. Brianna, you lost a heart. You really do love me. Brianna, you lost a heart. You really do love me. We should go on a date sometime. I'm sorry, Jake, but I don't think I'm your type. I'm Brianna. Who? The weird girl. <laughs> There's no way that's you. Goodbye, Jake. You're doing great. You already got someone to fall in love with you. Yeah. Isn't it great? I told you not to snore. I only need three more people to fall in love with me, and then I can meet my soulmate. Look, there's a guy right there. What do I do? Wink at him. Act cute. Play with your hair a bit. Whoa, is everything okay here, little man? Ah. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I was actually trying to flirt with you. <laughs> oh, you were? I thought there was something wrong with you. Hey, my name's Jason. What's yours? Brianna. We should exchange numbers. Okay. You lost another heart. No way, your makeup is working great. Hey, Bri. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Your makeup is working great. Hey, Bri. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Brianna, look at this insect I found. <laughs> wow, let me see. Brianna, tell him. Kevin, I'm sorry, but 
We can't be friends anymore. I'm trying to get boys to fall in love with me, so I can't be seen with the weird guy. I really hope that getting boys and being popular is worth losing who you are. So after class, we'll go looking for the next guy. Anna, don't wear your glasses. I can't see anything. Why do I have to change everything about myself to get boys to like me? Why can't I just eat me? Brianna, wait. This is just so boys will fall in love with you so you can find your soulmate. Once you find your soulmate, you can go back to being yourself again. And who's to say my soulmate's going to love me for who I am? No one else does. Brianna, you lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. You lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. Hey, Brianna. Your grades are doing phenomenal. You're looking really good these days. I like your new look. I'll see you in class. You think it was Mr. Stevens that fell in love with you? For his wife and kids sake? I hope it's not him. Okay, right in front of you, that's Chad. He's one of the hottest guys in the school. Go up to him and ask if he would like to attend Devin's party with you. Kevin's walking this way. So? Hi, Kevin. Don't talk to me. You're too cool for me, remember, Brianna? <laughs> Brianna, what are you doing? Go talk to Chad. Right. Chad. Hi, what's your name? I'm not sure we've met before. <laughs> Stop! Boys don't like it when you cry! I don't care! I don't care about Chad! I'm in love with Kevin! Is Kevin more important than your soulmate? He is! Then go to him! Kevin, I- Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend-girlfriend! Me too! <laughs> I love you, Cynthia! Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend-girlfriend! Me too! <laughs> I love you, Cynthia! How'd it go with Kevin? Did you tell me you like him? He likes someone else. Brianna, you lost your last heart! Someone else fell in love with you. Chad. No, it wasn't Chad. It was me. Oh? Not in a romantic way, in a platonic way. I fell for you when I saw that you stay true to yourself and what you want. The only person left to fall in love with you is your soulmate. That means I'm going to find my soulmate anytime now. That's the girl I remember. <laughs> it's so great to be myself again. Hey, do you mind if I sit next to you? Uh, okay. Does anyone know the answer to this equation? 7,422. Girl who knows her math. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's you. What? Nothing. Congrats on finding your soulmate and getting him to fall in love with you. What's this? It's a list of all the people who fell in love with you before your soulmate. The third person on the list is Kevin. Oh, another day, another charge. <clears throat> what? Mom, I need to borrow your charger. No, I'm using it. I'm only at 10%. I'm going to die. Here, hurry up. <clears throat> it's not working. Let's try this. That's the emergency charger. This is an emergency. <clears throat> it didn't work. There must be something wrong with my charging port. Did I hear something wrong with the charging port? Hold still. Hold what? <clears throat> what happened? You made it worse. I'm at 2% now. There's one more thing we can try. Come with me. Wait. I may have caved and texted my ex-boyfriend at 2 a.m. that I miss him. He replied with, come over. I didn't go, okay? I don't need a baby. This is going to tell me if my ex is the one I'm meant to be with or not. I'm going to take that as a no. Honey, did you just use the bathroom? <laughs> No. Oh no, you aged! You were lying! You can't ever lie, because every time you lie, you get older. Look, I dyed my hair green! Ah! It looks really good. It doesn't look like I've aged. Hey, Eugene, I didn't do the homework. Can you give me all the answers? Brianna, are you trying to cheat? No! Hey, Sophie, I've lied twice today, and I haven't aged at all. I think I'm immune. No way, you're so lucky. Hey, Timmy. You're handsome. Thanks, Brianna. That's so nice of you. And Jimmy, those are really nice shoes. Really? You think so? I've said so many lies today, and I haven't aged at all. Look in the mirror. 